Did Meghan Markle model her garden party look after Kate Middleton? See their outfits side by side. Royal fashion protocol, perhaps? Meghan Markle made her royal debut as the Duchess of Sussex on Tuesday, three days after her historic wedding to Prince Harry, at Buckingham Palace's annual garden party which also served as an early celebration for Prince Charles' 70th birthday. And she dressed to impress her new royal family, seemingly taking cues from her sister-in-law Kate Middleton's outfit worn to her first garden party in May 2012, pantyhose and all. Dot. Let's break down their stylish duchess off, shall we? And for her debut, Meghan went full-on royal, down to her sheer stockings, turning to a London-based women's wear label goat fashion. She wore the brand's elegant rose pink Flavia pencil dress featuring a tailored bodice pencil skirt and a silk chiffon yoke and sleeves. The sleek silhouette hit below the knee. Meghan added a custom Philip Tracy hat, similar to this style, to complement her look, matching pumps, a coordinating Wilbur and Gussie clutch and Vanessa to Gend half diamond rosy de Lira rings. Her dress is currently on sale for $450, while sizes last. We all know, everything Meghan touches turns to sold. And you can also shop similar styles right here. When Kate attended her first garden party in 2012, one year after celebrating her marriage to Prince William at Buckingham Palace, she also wore a long sleeve pink look and a tilted hat. Kay turned to one of her favorite coat dresses, a pink, pleated, $2,000 Amelia Whipstead design, for the annual affair at Buckingham Palace, as she mingled with over 8,000 guests alongside Queen Elizabeth, Prince Philip, Prince Charles, Camilla and other members of the royal family. She accessorized her look with a matching pink hat by Jane Corbett. She added L.K. Bennett sledge pumps and her go-to Natalie clutch from the British label. The placement of both their pink hats is exactly the same, tilted to the right. Meghan, however, wore her hair up in a sleek bun, a departure from her usual messy style, while Kate opted for her signature messy blowout. Their earrings also differed, with Prince Harry's wife opting for diamond floral studs and Kate choosing pearl earrings. While their garden party looks were very similar, their wedding dresses were completely different styles. Meghan's white silk gown, designed by Claire Waite Geller for Givenchy, featured an open bottom neckline and sculpted waist. The train flowed in soft round folds cushioned by an underskirt and triple silk organza. The slim three-quarter sleeves added a note of refined modernity. Kate's dress, however, was a different silhouette and incorporated different fabrics. For her royal wedding to Prince William in April 2011, Kate wore a fitted white v-neck gown with a long sleeve lace overlay, designed by Alexander McQueen creative director Sarah Burton, and full skirt. Her dress featured French Chantilly lace and English Clooney lace throughout the bodice, skirt and underskirt, 